I'm Maurice Ostro from YPO, from the Leadership Development Network, and we have here Ian Bremer, the great commentator on globalization. And we would love to ask you, Ian, it's the very beginning. Davos is just about to start. What is the one thing that around the world our CEOs ought to be thinking about in terms of globalization? What are the impediments? What are the things that should be on their radar screen? Uh, that we're hitting a turning point. I mean, if I think about all of our lives, globalization has been moving towards more openness, right? More porous borders for people, ideas, goods, services, data. That was true after World War II ended. It became even more true when the Chinese started opening in the 70s and 80s. Even more true in 1988, the wall comes down, 91, the Soviet Union collapses. And yet now, for the first time in our lifetimes, the fact that the Americans and the Chinese are actively decoupling their technology systems for each other is the most meaningful step away from globalization that we've ever experienced. Now, now if you're talking about the CEO of a corporation whose money and long-term profitability and strategy comes from globalization, all the good things that come with it, you know, the reduction in, in extreme poverty around the world and the improvement of education, the expansion of lifespan, I mean, all of these things, suddenly you go, whoa, this is, a, this is not what people want to see here at Davos. This is not what your membership wants to see. It's a serious problem. And, and it's not reversible anytime soon. So that, that's what they're worried about, and that's what they need to be addressing and adapting themselves for. A worrying message, but forewarned is forearmed, and hopefully our members and others here will have some ideas to repair some of this rift. And even if you think it's unlikely that it'll happen very soon, we need to be prepared. So as businesses, how we react. So thank you very much. Thank you for joining us sure. and for setting the scene for our members as we come into this first week of Davos 2020. Good talking, Mars. Thank you. Yeah.